Now, I've had this big old wooden summer house in the garden for about 10 years now. And over the years, it's had a variety of different types of paint on it. So what Laura and I did was we heavily sanded it down first. Then we moved over to a lighter sandpaper and sanded it down so it's ready to paint. Over the years, the timber started to expand and detract. And it's got little cracks in it there. So we put some filler in there the day before to let it dry. Now, because of the vast area of this, we're going to spray it up to make it a little bit quicker. So in precautions for that, I've masked up the windows. It's really Really easy to do, quick and easy. It's a polyphene masking and then you mask around the edges. All I've got to do now is paint it. I'm using a Wagner paint spray from the DIY range. It's simple to use and perfect for these large areas. They can be used with French Cheek's whole range of chalk paints. I'm holding the nozzle approximately four inches away from the surface and slowly moving from side to side. Now another advantage of using the spray paint technology is you can adjust the nozzle setting. I've been spraying from left to right, but now I want to spray up and down. So you simply twist the nozzle on the front, tighten it up, and it's ready to spray. Now that's two beautiful solid coats of Palmer Violet done on the four sides of the summer house. The next stage is to paint the window frames and also cut in around the beading around the front windows and door. So the next colour I'm going to use is Old Blue Eyes from the Alfresco range. Frenchie's unique oval and flat brushes allow you to apply a nice thick layer of paint in tricky areas creating a beautiful even finish. Before the paint dries, carefully remove the masking tape. 